third time's the charm. Holy smokes, before I get this video started, good lord, Austin just got a super speeder ticket. Ha, <laughs> that's funny. Appreciated. Please hold the line and we'll be right back with you. So, what'd you say? They sent you another, another one of these. Yeah, another fuse relay. Okay. Impressive yeah. work. Man, dude, that's stupid. That's weird. Thank you for your payment. I can't be the only person. Thank you for waiting. That's how it's fine. Thank you for waiting. That's how it's fine. So, it's still not working. I guess third time is not the charm. Not the charm. Cool as it is, man. Static life. Uh, not even my car, and I'm frustrated. I don't even. I don't even hate that. Like, I don't even know what I hate about it, man. I don't care about how much I spent on it. It's just the fact that it don't run after you spend after it's brand new, you know. Yeah. And like it, I don't know. You follow the diagram and exactly how it's printed out, and it still don't cut on. You are currently calling number four. That don't make no sense on a brand new car. So I know it's not like a battery issue or anything. The remote's cutting on. Everything else turning over except the compressor. Like I hate to bash airlift, but I'm bashing airlift, dude. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Real ridiculous. The compressor doesn't run. There's a blown fuse or relay. We replace the relay. Bad ground or poor electrical connections. We got all the wires literally tied, like uh, taped together, so it can't be a bad electrical connection. If anything, it should blow up because of how close we got them. <laughs> uh, a blown fuse. I know the fuse ain't blown because we've checked that uh, plenty of times. So it says to replace the fuse, check the ground, or check the compressor connector. We've done all that. Thank you for waiting. You soon. Please hold the line, and we'll be right. Directory. Please. Hey, that fuse looks like it's busted. From out of the box, it came like this too. For traditional mobile clerks, please press the oh, see if I can get a better look at it. So, yeah, out of the box, it's hard to see it. Oh my god, I'm back to four. But out of the box, I think this fuse is blown. And it's really hard to see, so maybe that's what the problem is because we couldn't see it. Okay, so we don't have the exact right fuse, but we're going to try one just to see if we can get it to work. Hopefully, this, this is what connected. the problem is. I know this one's connected, or else the remote. So, so this one goes right here, right? Mm -hmm. This one goes right here, right? Yeah. <sighs> this is, this is going to work. All right, gotta connect that back to the battery. Yes. No, it's connected. It's gonna work. I just started messing with it, honestly. It's gonna work. This is not gonna be the first time we fail on an install. I am the one, the one, your time don't need the gun to get respect up on the street. They sent a blown fuse to us and we couldn't see it because it was it's was so hard to see it, oh see the blown God. fuse, but they sent us a blown fuse. Oh! Oh, man. A week and a half. A week and a half because of a fuse. I can't believe it. Listen, camera. Listen, camera, man. This man right here, this man right here, has helped me bag my car more than I thought I knew how to do this. This man right here went and got a picture frame holder from Walmart 
to help me put in my fuse and then found out the fuse was just not connected. This man is a genius. Yes. <laughs> oh my god, let's put the tank in. Oh. Finally. Dude. I thought we were putting stock coils back on. Dude. Oh. <laughs> ah, let's get the tank. We airing something up today. So much brainstorming, and they sent us a bad fuse. All this, man, for a fuse. Now, now we just gotta rewire this. God, we're gonna look so dumb on YouTube. You idiots! You couldn't look at the freaking fuse. You're dumb. <laughs> God, I would have figured that out a week ago. Uh, you guys are retarded. <laughs> hey, mom. Since we're professionals now, let us put some bags in your car. Bags? Yeah. No. Well, it, it's adjustable, so you just won't be low all the time. You have adjustable suspension. You should. No. Come on, we're professionals. Are you me? Yep. No. We'll do it for cheap. My infinity is already good. Okay. Yeah. Huge. We finally caught a W. I can't believe it. Now, got the trunk put back in. Just gonna finish wiring everything up and we'll be done. That would ruin my whole video. <laughs> you would just have to scrap that whole thing. So what we're doing right now is we're running the system and making sure there are no leaks. So far so good. So as of right now, it's doing the calibration. I don't know if you can see it, but it's moving. Oh, there it goes with it. And it's airing up for the first time, finally. Oh, it's like, it's way higher, you can, it's drivable now. Woo wee! <laughs> Look at that boy airing that thing out. That dude. Look at that. <laughs> Sweet. All right, bros. I'm editing this video right now. I just wanted to throw in some clips of um, 
the WRX airing up and down because I didn't get to get any when we, the day we were doing the install. But uh, yeah, don't hose us too bad because we couldn't figure it out. We finally got it figured out and it's working. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. Peace out.